Hey everyone, Jim again with another Shamped Minute. Uh, this is the opening weekend of the new film Zero Dark Thirty, uh, directed by the uh, Oscar-winning director of The Hurt Locker, Catherine Bigelow. direct me. Sorry. Um, anyway, this movie uh, chronicles the hunt for Osama bin Laden, um, uh, the most wanted man on the planet for over a decade. Um, let me be right up front and say it's, it's a dramatization. It's not a documentary, so there's a lot of historical inaccuracies in it. But as a dramatization, and as a movie that uh, has to reach a sort of emotional truth, it succeeds brilliantly. Um, it's almost three hours long, but it keeps you riveted. Um, it's, it stars Jessica Chastain, who apparently is kind of a hot commodity right now. This is the first film I've seen her in, um, but she was riveting to watch. Uh, also, but the guy that I was paying attention to was Jason Clark. Uh, he was also in Lawless, and he, I thought he was fascinating. I definitely want to keep my eye on him. The plot's basically really simple. It's about, you know, from 9-11-2001 up through, I think it was May 2011. It's that this one woman, uh, she goes by the name Maya, uh, in different source materials she's been called other names, but in the movie she's called Maya. And she has a theory about where Bin Laden is, that he's in a compound hiding in plain sight in Pakistan, where everyone else believes that he's in a cave in, Af in Tora Bora, Af Afghanistan. Of course, she's right. <laughs> There's really no spoiler here. We know how the movie ends, and yet it's still riveting from beginning to end. It plays out a lot. I kind of kind of felt like I was watching a season of a television series because characters would come in and then they would leave, and then new characters would come in and they'd interact for a while and they would leave. But there was just still these couple main characters that were that uh, can reign consistent throughout. So in that way, yeah, it had it had kind of a TV series feel to it, um, which certainly isn't a bad thing. Um, the the raid on Bin Laden's compound, um, from what I've read on IMDb, I guess I think it takes like two minutes less than the actual raid did, so a lot of attention was paid to the technical details of it. Um, Catherine Bigelow is a masterful director. Uh, she's done some of the movies that, if not my favorite movies or even great movies, they're movies that had huge impacts on my life. Yeah, I'm definitely giving this one an excellent recommendation. Zero Dark Thirty, it's just been nominated for Best Picture, I think deservedly so. I enjoyed it, and I think it's an important film to go see. Okay, that's it. This has been The Sham Minute with Jim, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.